Let's continue. Hello. Okay, Sonia now Sanchez cut this out. Welcome um, to the Sonia show. Wow. A new arcade game called Furious Tanks oh, wait, is this sweeping is new. the nation. Its creator, unknown, as is the player with its high score, who goes by the initials WDO. Big news, viewers. I've located a source who saw the missing teen I discussed in a previous episode. Let's call him now. Hello, you're on the air. May I ask what your name is? You can call me Gerald. Hello, Gerald. Gerald. Say hello, Gerald. everyone. Hello. So, Gerald, you saw the missing teen? Yeah, I gave the kid a ride. Well, tell us more. Looks like the cat's got your tongue. I did want to say something else. Something to you, Sonia. What is it? I'm coming for you. Oh, that's new. Okay then, live TV folks. Let's move on, shall we? Now let's take a moment Dang. to look at the latest candidate polls. Guess that's staying in the video, because that was new. Looks like Tyrak is still the preferred candidate. Holy abstain. As we approach election day, Half more and more protests the population are of this country, country hasn't Vote voted. Tyrak and put the brigades in jail. Wow. As you know, the Sonya show is very concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing teen report. All right, our choices today Remember, are 17, 11, 4, 16, 0, 4, 18, 8, 4. Uh, I like going for the older ones just because in case I want to take the exam route out of here, I can do so. Uh, the hotline is available 24 hours, for seven for energy. They're all for energy. This guy Let's is... Bring these teens back home. Dealing a car. Yes. And that has been the Sonya Show. This will probably be the final one. It's six. There's six episodes in total, if I remember correctly. Yes, because the actual episodes of my first run go to 6.2. 12 episodes total. Each episode in the game separated into two separate parts. And today, today, we're praying for time. Look outside. Ah, air. It smells dusty. Oh, food. Mind if I do? Uh, turn on. And as a reminder, Never stop Money. to pick up hitchhikers, Food. young or old. They could be dangerous. And that's today's Sonia show. I Thanks think we've been on this in. one before. If we have, then you won't see anything past this point. So, welcome back. As you can see, it was Jared, um, the one, if you go back to, I believe it was 4.2. Anyway, there's one where you, you you drive the car. Jared is what is in front of the car, so you stop. He gets in, and in that episode, I got him to the point where he had his gun out, and yada yada yada. Go watch the other series; you'll see it. It's in there. Yeah, a really good episode too. Oh, and this is Alex again, so I'll probably skip over this as well. And if you don't want me to, Can you well, hear me? this scene is in the other it's a episodes. Bug with so the go watch it there. But don't worry. Bus time. There's gotta be a bus scene I haven't gotten yet. This game just uh Oh, this game hits so hard. It's so good. You got two left. Two that we have not seen yet. Can we get them? I want. I want to get the ones we haven't gotten Welcome yet. Welcome aboard, kid. 
We've gotten this already. Been a long time. A couple of weeks now, but it feels longer than that. You? Not the same. Mm. Are you frightened? Uh, never actually. Sorry, but I don't believe you. What you should do now is rest. If you can rest, you'll feel better. That's rest. After all, we're almost done the second run through this game. Which is funny because I've blasted through the past encounters. Just zoom. Oh, wait, gay. Them. Wait, gay. What are you, Canadian? That's my thing. Um. Hmm. Don't mind if I do. Um. Is next stop far? Not far. No. Yeah, I'll get off next stop. That's three encounters down. We've been on this run in particular for 15 minutes. <laughs> I've been going coasting through these. All right, what are we at now? Oh, it's this one. Uh, that's one thing with playing the game over again is you, you can recognize when you're at the same encounter. Like, I, I know exactly what happens here. Up, up, up. Go to the end and use the lockpick. Here we go. Woohoo! Now park in front of the cameras and get ready. Stop shouting through the vent. Uh, okay, yes, we can get a ton of stuff here. Just let me hack it and grab all of it right now, because I can. Um, I'm just going to close that. I was never in that room. Um, hi, Tarek. Um, ooh, food. I'm at a full bar. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. Mind if I just lose? Because those are rigged for you to lose every single time. Somebody's been trying a couple times here. Uh, uh, okay, let's sit. Who was that guy? Looks like the security service sent an agent. Open this door immediately. Nope. Listen, you don't want any trouble. Give me the manager's office code. Don't give him the code, kid. We're close to finding where this creep is going to attack. What happens if I give him the code? I'm doing it. The kid betrayed us. Let's get out of here. But we still don't know where he's going to attack. It's too late. Let's go. Hey, stop right there. Cool. Well, I'm going to take a chair and uh, look what's in here. Ooh, car key. Uh, okay, cool. Uh, mm -hmm. Out I go. Fall over. Stand it, bitch! This is not like a car that I would want to be driving. It looks like it was already in an accident, but I mean... Yeah, we'll do it. I mean, I don't know if one of the missing, one of the two missing encounters I have include me being the driver of the car. Probably not. So I mean, if I wanted a new encounter, I probably should have gone with walking or hitchhiking. This is the final, final time coming to Road 96. Ooh, that's just a rock. And I probably will not do any more videos on this game. I mean, I could fish for the two I am missing. <laughs> I got just some heavy breathing. Holy, that was loud. 
but as I was saying, I probably won't do any more videos on this series. It's this game deserves it, but there's a whole lot more content for me to cover in this game. I could fish for the two I am missing, but that would take a lot of time. Only trust yourself. Yes, that is a good one, actually. Enjoy your life. Enjoy your life. Life should be enjoyed. And that... This game kind of sends that message around where like, it's your life. Take control of your life. And enjoy the moments. So I go deeper into that afterwards. I can't wait to focus on getting across the border, potentially. I've died twice. This... This, this entire episode is going to be dying. <laughs> oh, man. This is so rough. When historians look back on this September 9th, many will consider it the most important day ever in the history of Petria. It's perfect. The entire country will be watching. I agree. The time to act is now. Zoe. Intelligence says the brigades will try something, Mr. President. If they do, I'll crush them once and for all. Of course, I'll be here all day, reporting live at the scene. This has been Sonia Sanchez for GNN. And cut! What are you doing back there, kid? <laughs> Stan and Mitch aren't here because they don't know the location, they don't know anything. Oh, gosh. Can I get through? You'll have to wait until they're done with this story. Now move along, or I'll move you myself. Oh, are you crying, Sonia? Yes, she Good is. Girl. Dad here. In 86. Might as well do it now. This is for you, Lola. Lola was her name. What happens I, here? I, I tried. Oh, I, I know what happens here. Save her. But, but the rocks, they, they kept coming. It's just, sometimes, I, I wish I had died. And she lived. Oh, Sonia. Saw my brothers recently. It'd been ages. I haven't been so kind <laughs> to the ones I love lately. So that's a lot shorter to Stan and Mitch aren't there. That leaves just the brigades. Time to cut the head off the snake. How interesting. Snacks and drinks? Can I help you at all? So, we'll see what happens. Hi. Who wants to know? Someone looking across. Maybe I can help with that. The important word being maybe. Uh-huh. I got 50 bucks. That's enough, all right. We'll leave later, when it's dark. Okay? Sounds good. Okay, before we go farther, I'll need what we agreed on. Hey, Come on, we've got some walking to do. Got some walking to do. <laughs> uh, a little bit of horror in here. Just no, uh, no, it doesn't hurt, right? <laughs> Hold up. That light ahead should be the guard I know. Stay here. Okay. All good. You can come down. Eh. Hi. Come on. This way. What's up, dude? Nice little shack you got there. Almost there. Now, I've only done this with someone else. If I'm by myself, do they still come rushing through, kidding? rushing That's through with for? cars? 
I'm expecting a SUV to come barely into the woods. Yep. Hurry. Climb wall. Go. I can't go. I killed her. Oh my gosh. Can I go backwards? Yeah, no. I, I didn't make the roll. Dang, I just died all three times. I should have brought the kids and at least save him. Yes, you might lose your life along the way. Oh well. But for each person that falls, another rises up. Oh well. Holy crap, people are just shooting people everywhere. The trick is to keep moving forward. Dang, we've died th all three times. Ooh, there is a seventh episode here. What does this mean? It's only six left. <laughs> Well, let's go ahead and hop right into the last one. Hello, Sonia Sanchez here. Welcome to the Sonia Show. Now, let's take a moment to look at the latest candidate polls. Looks Ooh. like Tyrak is still the preferred candidate. Only a quarter election of day, the country's more actually more protests voting. Are occurring in our that is country. insane. Vote Tyrak and put the brigades in jail. As you My know, word. the Sonya Show is very concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing teen report. Remember, if you have any information, please call the Sonya Hotline. You are real close. We'll go for middle lot more money and, uh, and more that age. Has been the Sonya Show. We started there. That seems awfully close compared to other starts. I wonder if the game has it built in to where it gives you the ones you haven't gotten yet. That'd be cool. Do I think I've seen this one? Yeah, I've seen this one. Well, as always, I'm gonna skip over it. Wow, you look rough. Thanks, I guess. Don't mention it. What is it? Looks like you got something on your mind. Elections almost here. I know. I'm rooting for Flores, of course. Even made a donation of ten dollars to her campaign. A lot of scratch for me. Look back in the red. Same to you, man. We're gonna be over here pumping gas for this son of a gun, aren't we? Say, you look familiar. Nope. You're one of those teens on the posters. Nope. You can't make me do it. Ooh, Karki. I probably shouldn't take a car though, because as I said, cars won't give me anything new. No. Okay, let's. Simple. I'd have to call the cops. Yeah, I better call them. I oh, am. Yeah. See that pump? Serve gas for me and we won't have any problems. Yeah, right. I'm just gonna walk to your store. Can I steal stuff from your store for being a total dingus? Ha, <laughs> no TV for you. All right, fine. We'll go ahead and we'll pump gas. Here we go. Don't blow this. Don't blow this. Ten liters of unleaded. Make it fast. Unleaded is the green. The green is what I need. Unleaded is the green.
Sit. I forget what he wanted. I said ten liters. This better not ruin my baby's engine. <laughs> Nine to twenty. Oh, any mistakes will be docked from your pay. Fine. And now, a sneak peek of today's Sonia show. Tyrak has proposed canceling the election to save taxpayers hard-earned money. That's Tyrak, always that looking out for our interests. <laughs> Tune in later to hear more. The Sonia show. Now that's the real news. That's not how elections go. Like, really? Like, hmm, I don't, hmm, um. Give me $15 of diesel. Fifteen dollars diesel coming right up, sir. There you go, sir. Nice, thanks. You're welcome. What? You got a job working here? Didn't have a choice. I don't want your kind around here. My kind? What do you mean, my kind? I know what you're up to. Trying to leave the country. Maybe you should go. Border crossers. Tyrak is right to do to you what he does. Oh, look who's pulling <gasps> in. Yeah, you'd better run. Poor kid. Wish I could help you, but I can't. Wait, it's Fanny. Hey, little young to pump gas, aren't you? What can I get you? Just give me 12 bucks of V power. V power. Did I see power. a kid run off? You did, yeah. How's that for a guilty conscience? Didn't I ask for twelve dollars of V power? Thanks, Peach. Yeah, twelve dollars of V power. I gave that, that to you. Gosh, Fanny. You hear about the hitcher? Nope. Just for the gas. He ran off towards my shed. I know he plans to cross. He said as much. Yes, hey, man. And who are you? I'm hit you too, sucker. Stay right there, okay? Mm. Come on, Reed. I'll let him do it. Flip me. I know Can't. what you're thinking, Peach Fuzz. Hey, what am I thinking? You want to help the kid, but that would be a mistake. You understand what I'm telling you? Mm, nope. I'm a dumb dumb. Please explain. Come out, kid. We know you're in here. I wonder where he's hiding. There you are. Where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going? I'm a police I officer. Leave me alone. You hear that? Kid's innocent. Uh-huh. Just like all the others. Get him in the van. I'll join you in a sec. Now, what about this one? Hi. What about me? This one's legit. Works here. I don't know. Look how dirty he is. Looks like a crosser to me. You old pig. What was that? No, what? Mm. You're coming to the station with us. Think I care? I'll take it from here. Yo, what? I'll book him. Besides, saves you room to pick up another kid. Fine, I guess. Nah. Shut up, kid. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! You can't prove I'm a crosser. Okay, you can go. Letting me go. I am. You didn't break any law? Those guys were just on a power trip. Sorry I yelled at you like that. Had to make it look real. Yeah, I know. Thanks for helping, and I guess. I'm sorry about the other kid. He seemed nice. I think so. Yeah, seems like you want to ask me something. Yeah, um, the person who died crossing. It should have never happened. That's what I think. I agree. It happened for no good reason. There's never a good reason for a kid to die. That's for sure. Bye, Peach Fuzz. 
Take care, okay? All right. Do you have car keys? I'm talking about talk to you, jerk. She let you go. Pay me for my crap, dude. Fine. Just take it easy, okay? Thanks. Now I will leave you alone in your crappy gas station. Like, look at that sign. What happened to your other one? Like, that can't be the original sign. Let's go. Please be more than words. Ooh, is this the one I'm thinking about? Oh, please be the one I'm thinking about. It is such a good encounter. Please be the, please be it, please. Oh, it totally is. Oh, I love this encounter. Hi. And they just disappear. So long. A little stop and and <laughs> through the door. Let's go. Oh man, when I first came through this, oh, so good. Just a rundown house. The song obviously adds a lot to it. Hey, look, picture. Take it. Um, you'll need the pictures, obviously. Um, we need this picture. Uh, I like the food. Why not? Uh, rotting, though. Uh, I forget what the third picture is. Oh, hey. Ah, oh, right, it's in here. That's money. It's in this one. Ah, there we go. Thank you. Three photos, so let's go. We got the three photos. Now we go and look inside this. Okay, the day we met. Um, we want the picture one. The day we met, you stopped to give me a ride. I'd been hitchhiking, hitchhiking for days and was starting to see things. The day we had our first argument, you cut your knee on the rock, stooping into the waterfall, like I said you would. Last page. The day we knew we were meant to be together, we stayed up all night talking about our lives and our future. Just this scrapbook in three pages tells a deep story of a couple, and it's, it's, this doesn't hit you quite hard yet, but this fourth page that you unlock, the day we tied the knot, we saw a beautiful old tree on the side of the road. We climbed the hill to reach it, and underneath it, you proposed to me as the sun was setting. That is just that picture, if you visualize that is beautiful. But the scrapbook, it doesn't end of the there. And what's up the hill? The tree. We go from that, we go up this hill towards the tree. You can see the two up there. By the tree. And like the shadow figures. And look how beautiful this is with the sun setting. The, the mountain. You got the tree here. Then there's the image of the him proposing to her. Oh, look at that. It's so sweet. And then they disappear. It's wedding bands. Why would there be wedding bands here? Let's find out, shall we? Let's 
put the, the rings down, shall we? Shall we? Shall we? Shall we? We shall. Bye. Now, what does this fourth page say? Well, it's fifth page. But one morning, we woke up knowing we were now different from the people we'd been. That day, we went back to the same old tree. Our tree. When it was done, when we'd filled it in the hole, we hugged for the last time. Then, we went our separate ways. Hence the car speeding off. So simple. From the car in the tunnel with the two figures, which indicates where they first met, to walking through the hallway and then into the ruined house. Then from the ruined house, after you learn a bit of the story, you walk up the hill to a beautiful scene. Like, look how beautiful this is with the sun, mountains, this tree, the surrounding cliffs. And you come up here after you're told, after you learn that this is where they proposed. Well, he proposed. But then you come and you find the rings. The rings unlock the fifth page. And upon putting the fifth page, unlocking the fifth page, the car zips out. There's a lot of symbolism in this scene. And though, though it's short, though I did kind of blow through it fast, it, there, there's so much here. More than just a simple tale of a couple that kind of lost their love, but there's more to it than that. And you can you can apply this to just life in general. You know, maybe instead of the person you're in a relationship with, if you are currently in one, you know, whether it's about your sweetheart or not, you can apply it to your dreams, your goals, um, to work, to your, a project maybe yeah, you're, you're working on. You know, it has to start somehow. And the start can be rough sometimes. And maybe the journey to, through it as you're working at whatever it may be or with whatever it may be or whoever it may be, you might scrape your knee like it says when you jump into the waterfall. You know, you'll, you might run into something that kind of puts a, a knot in what would have been a very smooth plan. But of course, you can work through it, get past it. And maybe you do. Maybe you don't. that doesn't stop you. And then you come to a beautiful moment where things are starting to fit. You know, the puzzle is starting to actually look like something. You got maybe a few pieces left, but you've got it. And then there's excitement, like the proposal. There's excitement towards whatever it is. But what if you find out that something's different? What if something changes? Does that change affect what you're doing? But whether it's the dream you're working towards, or maybe it's your job, maybe something changed at whatever job you're doing, or yet again, whatever, you, whatever it may be, maybe something changes. Does that change Lead you towards doing what they did. Taking the rings. And putting it away. Hiding it in a hole. Basically going back on all the progress you'd made. You retreat in a, in a, in a way. You retreat away from whatever it was. Instead of pushing through it, you leave, you leave it alone. Forget about it. 
And in this instance, they literally went back to the exact same tree as it says here. That day we went back to the same old tree. Then it even said our tree. Then the last time we said goodbye. Now you go one way and then you leave whatever it was in, in the past, whether it is a project you were working on or a goal you had in mind that you wanted to accomplish or a job that you were working at. You leave it, leave it behind and you move on. Now, that's either a good change or it could be a bad change. It doesn't, I mean, it can go either way. But the analogy still stays the same. Now, sometimes in life, you will work towards something. That's the, something may change, within, which then changes your perspective on whatever it is. And then from there, you either stick with it and push through, or maybe you find something new that you're into or want to do. But... And again, the outcome can be different depending on circumstance. But I just, this scene, the first time it hit, it hit a lot harder, and it still hit pretty hard this time through. Oh man, it's just so good. That's why this game is so good. It, it just does that so well. Hitchhiking's the way to go. Take him out of water. Yeah, that's the rest of it. Cool. Let's go. We travel so little distance. Yo, we got Fanny 100%. We see Stan and Mitch. Hmm. Maybe I will get all of them done today. That'd be cool. Nothing's gonna stop us now. Please be new, please be new, please be new. Kid, up here! It's not up new. Here. Dang it. Huh, I've never seen that shade of green before. He's gonna get sick on the hog stand. I knows it. I won't get sick, promise. What'd you say, kid? Can't hear ya, on account of the wind. Little buddy says he won't get sick on the hog, Stan. Mitch, hard as I try, I can't hear you neither, on account of the wind. Truly a straight model you have. I see your lips are moving, and I know you are speaking to me. Yet pains me to say, I cannot hear you. I know, on account of on the wind. On account of the wind. Mitch, check the bag. Better still be there. What if I, I could, Stan? Now you know I have issues with the, the lower, lower lumbar. lumbar. Right, your issues with the lower lumbar. Kid, check the bag in the back. Okay. Watch! A furry friend! Aw, oh, that's too bad. Happens with the smaller life forms. I wow. should talk more to discourage them from a wandering out like this. Meep, meep. That's a lot of cash, by the way. Yeah, the bag's still, the bag's still there. The bag? Couldn't say, but it is not stolen dollar bills. <laughs> Most Damn. definitely is not. That's a lot of stolen it, money. Bitch. We robbed the big one. Holy First crap. National. Oh, congratulations. <laughs> That's mighty kind of you to say, kid. Hey, little buddy. That's ridiculous. You've heard of Stan and Mitch, right? This is definitely new, too. That's great. Uh, yeah, I have, actually. I knew it, Mitch! We're famous! Woohoo! But here we are, hogging the conversation. That's Maybe usual, you'd actually. Like to pose a topic of your own. Uh, the ship of the team died. I did. Awful is what it is. We That's true. We would have saved a kid had we been there. Yeah, we would have. How does it make you feel, kid? I want to leave more than ever. Well, good luck with that and everything. Yeah, good luck. Oh, what the heck? Hey, hmm. what are you looking at down there? Shucks, Mitch. Looks like we forgot a scratch. My brother and I are morally good. If you mind as the Robin with firearms. <laughs> gives you twenty dollars to cheer. <laughs> for the scratch. Tara gives you twenty bucks to cheer. <laughs> <laughs> 
Shoot! The cops, Stan! If they start shooting, we're gonna! Oh my god, that's so funny! Slowing down. You wanna throw our money? You're a genius! What? Stan! What? The kids throwing our money! Got a better idea? What? No! This is ridiculous! I'm throwing gym. bags of money at the cop car. What? We're so screwed. Shall you buy homage? Oh my gosh, this is insane. Keep throwing our money at the car. You won't be able to see soon. Aim for the windshield. Hard to see through dollar bills. That's that's true. Like this car's got so much money on the front of it now. Come Look on. at that. They're gaining on us. Come on, come on. Let me hit the ding dong car. Ha ha, jerk. Take that. Ha ha, time to get rich. Dare I ask who the criminals are now? Uh, <laughs> we lost them. But we lost uh, all our darn money. That's hilarious. It's your fault, kid. Oh my gosh. You told me to throw something. Actually, the kid's right. In my momentary fear, I did. Ooh. I'll take an extra dollar. Forgive me. I don't know if I can. Let me think about it. <laughs> Fine, I forgive you. Oh, Phew. gosh. That's a relief. Oh. Anyway, for helping us out back there, we'll take you a little waste further. Thanks. That was fun. That was, that was a lot of fun, actually. Um... Thanks, that's nice. Well, Mitch and I are nice people. No, really nice. I love Stan and Mitch, they're silly. They're so Stan silly. And Stan and Mitch! <laughs> oh gosh, I love those two. They're they're comical. That's what it, that's what they are. They're so comical. That's it, we did it. Actually, we actually got a hundred percent. That's wow, I didn't think I'd actually get that done. And what's great is it gave them to us here the final one too that's the wow i feel like even you game plus it will just give you what you're missing eventually like it's programmed in this so you can get the new stuff that you haven't seen before which is honestly very nice i like that if, it, if it's actually in there then that's very good for the developers to add that be considered enough to make sure that that people can get to see every single encounter that was planned that's good on him. Oh, uh, let's, let's get serious. Oh, it's this one. All right, well, we'll leave Stan and Mitch behind. That was only like five minutes of an encounter. That's that's real fast. Only like 15 minutes per encounter. Um, yeah, so the, the copyright music in here plus have already seen this. So if you want to see this scene again, I point you to the series. It's all on my channel. I have it in a playlist as well, so it's easy for, easy to find it all. Drop me wherever you want, Alex. It's time for our final approach to the wall. This is the last time we'll see this waterfall. We'll see this cave. We'll see the border. It's the last time. And thank goodness, because I am one stamina bar away from collapsing in exhaustion. And only trust yourself. I like this one. Ah, it's the pigeon one. We, didn't, we did not do it over there. 
Um. Oh no. That music's never a good sign. Can I burn myself? No, I can't. Why would I want to? Oh. Gift money. Do I need money? I'll leave 60 bucks actually. I can take. Was that out of 60 on my own? Yeah. Okay, well, I can't stop here. I gotta keep going. Pedro, I can see him now! Oh, right. This is what happens during your this. final approach. Right. Right. I forgot that this is what happens. All right. It's the final ending. <laughs> What did we get? I know we didn't get what we did last time because I did not choose anywhere near the same. So it's going to be different. Though the sequence of events leading to the end will be about the same. You look so beat up, dude. Um, who are you? I guess you don't remember me. We met at a gas station. I got arrested. You too, I think. We're in a holding cell. Oh, yeah, it's this guy. They brought you in last night. My head hurts. They beat you. That's why. But you should start to feel better soon. How long have you been here? Uh, too long. I just want to get it over with. Not following. Getting transferred to the pits. Oh, I see. I see. Oh, the day is just zip by. It's been a week. Oh, a week passes by and we're still here. Uh, uh, get your hands off take, me! Take him out. Where are you taking him? Your friend's been chosen for a new treatment. We'll turn him into a good teenager yet. Teenager. I'm just going to go ahead and tear these down. Tyrek can suck it. X. Guess we'll rest. Man, this ending just. Oh my gosh. It's a lot of time it just zips by. We're just sitting here in this cell. Leave me alone. Shut up. You shut You're up. Being transferred to the pit. Now get up. What's going on out there? What's, what's, what's the noise? It's election day, and scum like you want to make trouble. Oh yeah! Need to go. Now time to get you in the truck. Hi, Fanny. Fanny. Go, go, go. Fanny, no. Fanny. Max. Quiet back there. Max. Max. They fried him, man. I don't know if he can talk now. Max. Oh my gosh. What now? Just sit here? Please don't tell me we actually get sent to the pits and that's the ending. Don't tell me that's the ending. Don't tell me I did all those different choices just to get that ending. Talk to me, Max. Do I... Do I know you? Oh, that's right. They fried him so bad that he just... Max. That's so bad. What are they doing? They know we're in here, right? Stop that! Get your hands up! Stop! What was that? A prison van has just been flipped over. Go, go, get him out! Everybody, to the wall! Where the hell is Robert? Big John, did you see Alex? You saw Alex? Where is he? At the wall. Kid, come with me. I gotta find someone. Well, I thought we just picked us to go with him. 
Yeah, you you this kick that I'm door not. in. Let's go. Oh wow, look at that. Uh, let's go. There's an opening up here. Heck yeah, Alex, my Alex? man. Remember me? Give me a ride here. What are you doing? John, it's not what you think. Robert got someone to make the bomb using my blueprints. I'm trying to disarm it, but it's not working. Look at it. Robert must have changed the code. Dude is a straight up a-hole. He yeah. probably used a code you wouldn't know. What code did you try? 1919, the brigade radio frequency. And 1986, they seem the most logical. I have an idea. Young blood, try 6682. 6682. You sure? Hurry. 82. It worked! But how'd you know? That was the code of the first bomb. Your birthday. First bomb? Wow. My my birthday? Your mom and dad, Alex. Naomi and Steven. They built it and used the most important day of their lives as the code. We were going to use it. Oh, six. But there was oh, a problem six. at the last moment. 1882. That's Connie and I tried to take Tyrak out in the truck. We'd worked too hard to come up empty-handed. But we missed. And Tyrak detonated the explosives on the peak. And my parents were killed. Yes. And Connie. And so many others that day. Why didn't you tell me this sooner, John? I thought it'd radicalize you, push you to build the bomb. And I didn't want you to hate me. Hate you? If I had killed Tyrak, your parents would still be alive. They made their choices, Mr. Yu. They put themselves in that position. That's not on you. <sighs> Thanks for saying that, kid. Now, Penny! Don't move! Hands up and turn around. Slowly. It's you! The transmitter guy! Hands up, I said! Mom! Don't shoot! Alex? Your mom's a cop? Get out of here, Alex. That voice. Wait. Papa Bear? No! You know each other? Yeah. Turns out I've been chatting on the CB with the very person I was after. Well, it's not great for me either. The woman I love being a cop and everything. <laughs> love. Yeah. Love. Ha! <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Listen, I'm sorry I stood you up. I chickened out. You think I care about that now? My mom and Mr. Ursus were gonna go on a date? My mind is gonna explode. Alex, I told you, get out of here! Listen to your mom. So, how do you know each other again? I did some work for the brigades, for info on my bio parents. John knew them. Yeah, right. It's the truth. My girlfriend and I were friends with Alex's parents. Your girlfriend? She died in 86. I've been trying to protect Alex. You gotta believe me. It's true, Mom. John wasn't using me. He was trying to protect me. Look, I screwed up. I became a part of something that turned bad. Not a day goes by that I don't regret it. But I'm a different person now. I want to be with you. I'm a cop, and you're a wanted criminal. Forgive me, but I don't see how that could work. Mom, look around. Things are happening. Change is happening. Give John another chance. He screwed up, but we all make mistakes. You, for instance. Me? Yeah, I mean, come on, Mom. You know what Tyrek is doing to teens. I... I do. Yes. You really want to keep working for a government that does that? No. I haven't wanted to do my job for a long time now. But I did it. For you. Well, you no longer have to, Mom! Now, please, lower your gun!
There you go. We can cross together. There's nothing keeping us here. We can leave. Mom. What do you think? Kid, you can come if you want. Supporters on the other side of the wall have broken through and are now fighting the border forces with the brigades. Could this be it? Is the revolution really happening? So last time, I joined the fight. Since I know how that ending turns out, I'm going to escape so it gives more variety to the ending. This ending is just so good. It Might be a good time to go, sir. Kid, stop! Don't you dare shoot him. Zoe! 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 Fire at will. Sir? Do it. They kill Zoe? No. No. Zoe. I feel so bad for just leaving now. The revolution started that day, lasted for three more weeks. It spread to much of Petria, but did not prove successful in overthrowing Tyrak. Tyrak won the election and repealed the law limiting the number of possible presidential terms. And in the years that followed, my country became even more oppressive. If only more citizens had committed themselves to change, Petria might now be a much different place. I definitely prefer the first ending. The first ending that we did, well, that I did, I guess, was a lot better. I mean, well, it ends on a better note. In this one, I did get the different ending, which is kind of what I was going for. I was going for a different ending. I mean, sure, my character at the very last one got out, but it just... It doesn't feel right. If I could go back, I'd have my character just enter the fray and whether or not just die with everybody else. But that, that's the two different endings to the game. I'm not sure if they have any other v big variations to it. But that is it. We saw everything. Oh, look at that photo. Alex sleeping in the van. It is so good. This game is so good. Um, we can have to go faster too. I like that. Jared at peace on the beach with a dinosaur. I love that photo. Yeah, all the different songs are right there. All really good. I, I got the entire soundtrack because it's just... Mm, this game is so good. 
the gas station. The picture of Sodium and her brothers. They finally go on a date. Is that that's supposed to meet them at on a date? Oh, that's funny. So, ah, uh, there's everybody. All the characters. Ah. Uh, this, I don't know, this game just it has something real special about it. It is one of those games that no matter what happens, you end up enjoying every moment of it. Like, even the most Jared where you want to just punch your monitor because he just gets you. Even though it's just, just uh, it's such a good game. There's, oh, there's the dinosaur! The dinosaur! See, I hate, I don't hate Jared as much as I did. Um, now that I've seen all of his encounters, I actually don't mind him quite as much. He is still the most obnoxious of the six, but he's manageable. And of course, Zoe's still my favorite. I hate how he got her killed out. Doing that, but I wanted a different ending. I got, I got what I asked for. Um, but that is it. I've done everything. I've seen every encounter. I got all the achievements. I got both endings. There's not much more I can do with this game. Not to say I won't ever play this game again. I probably will. Because one thing this game does real well is it is, it's really good hidden hard, like, hidden the emotions really hard. You no, know, and it's a, it's a whole um, addition of music, setting, and then the small stories. I mean, the biggest one would be just the simple scrapbook storytelling they did. That right there was really good. And it didn't even include any of the six main characters that they have you encounter throughout your runs in the game. It was just completely separate, but it was still so good. Um, I, again, I, I just support this game entirely. This game is so good, I can't even speak words properly. I would definitely invite you all to go get this game yourself and support this game. It's so good. Of course, if you've seen every single episode that I have, then you would have seen everything the game has to offer. But you could still play it to get the feeling, because watching it, this game isn't quite the same as playing it. This is one of those games where you don't get the full feeling of it unless you are actually there making the choices. When you make the choices, it adds more to each scenario, to each encounter, to the ending, to how they all interconnect, because there are certain variations, granted the variations are small, to some of the encounters. Um, for example, if Zoe goes over the wall, before you meet John and Robert at the bar scene, th then when you go down to the brigade's hideout, there's a few more extra lines of dialogue because they've sent her over the wall, and so she... So Robert addresses that, and of course that's spoilers, but again, if you've watched to this point, I would hope you've watched the entire series up to this point, especially episodes 1.1 through 6.2, because that was the main series. This is going to be part two of the last journey, the final run through the game. So if you've seen this, then I would hope you've seen all of them. If you haven't seen all of them, if you've seen this, go watch the rest of them. You know, this game deserves all the publicity it can. It is so good for the game. The writing's well done. The art style is cool. The, the music is phenomenal. Like, I will continue to listen to the soundtrack of the game to, for years to come, and it's that good. It's, I can't express how great this game is. Like, if you like games that hit hard, that really get you there, this is definitely one of them. So it's Road 96. If you have any more games like this, so I 
love games like this. I have already recommended Firewatch from one of my friends there, which will definitely be coming up soon. So ex expect Firewatch to come up as a series soon. I know it's a shorter game. So expect Firewatch. If you have any other games that kind of hit like this one does, that kind of gets you right there, let me know. I love them. I'll do a series on any of them that come my way. So leave them down below. Um, as always, any if you have any, if, if you have any concerns, questions, comments, or suggestions, leave them down below. That section is there for you to let me know what you want me to know. And as always, you all have a good one. This is the end. And though it's the end of this game, it is not the end for this channel. We'll do more. And if, should there be extra things that come, we might return to this game just for nostalgia's sake. But that is everything. Have a good one, right?